hello everyone welcome back to my channel in the previous video we had talked about purchasing rated tables we have seen EKKO EKPO and other tables in this video we would be talking about inventory management tables so let us go inside the SAP system and check what are the important tables which are there in inventory management so we go into this transaction SE 11 and these are the tables which you would look at so first very important table is MSCG so we type in MSCG here and we display it so this is the material document table it has the number of the material document the year it also has the movement type the material number plant storage location batch stock type etc next up we would see MKPF so MKPF is the header table so that's MKPF. This is the header of the material document. So we have the material document number, year, document type is there, date will be there. So posting date is very important. So if you want to find the posting date of a material document, we have to go into this table. Okay. And uh, if you scroll down, we would have all other important uh, fields. Next is the reservation table, RESB. This is also a very important table when we do reservations. So RESP, if I enter, so this is the uh, table for reservation. So this is database table. So this table is for reservation and dependent requirements. So we have the number of the reservation, the record type, the requirement type. If you scroll down, we would find other important fields. So we have the missing part, uh, material number, plant and other important fields next up is ISEG ISEG is the physical inventory document so if I click on this icon and I go inside type this so this is the physical inventory document item so we have the document number the line item the material plan storage location all our key fields over here we also have the stock type the batch number and other important fields. Next up would be RKPF. So this is related to the reservation. So if I type in that table, RKPF, this is the header document. So in the header, we have the number of the reservation, the base date, the movement type is here. If you scroll down, we have the cost center details the asset number and the PO number is also there so these are the important fields which are there order number sales order number etc then we have the physical inventory document header IKPF so I click on this icon I enter IKPF so here we have the header details so we have the transaction type, the inventory document number, the plan, storage location, special stock indicator. So in IKPF, we also have the document date, the special stock indicator, and also the posting date and other important fields. Next, we would go into this master table for movement types. So this is a very important table. So if I type this uh, table, it is T156. So this is for the movement type. Okay, so this has the movement type, the debit credit indicator, the GR block stock consum consumption posting. If you scroll down, we have the batch creation control, account assignment for reservation, transaction event keys, the reason for movement, and the movement type category, reversal movement type, and all other details. So if we check over here, this is the master table. And if you want to find the text of the movement type, we have to go into this table. If you want to check the movement type quantity and value update, we have to type uh, this. So we have to suffix SY here. For movement type quantities posting, we have to suffix S. For posting string values, we have to suffix W. For posting string quantity we have to suffix M so this is the main table and if we want to 
find out these information so we have to suffix these as shown so this was all about the tables related to inventory management in the next video we would be checking more tables related to invoice verification so that is all in this video if you got value from this video do like comment and share with your friends do not forget to subscribe to the channel if you have any questions or feedback share them in the comment section below till we meet again next time you all take care and goodbye